Hey there YouTube, how's everybody doing out there today? I just got back from the gym myself, wanted to get it out of the way, knock it out this morning, and I'm back and I'm about to have myself a smoothie for kind of a pre-lunch or kind of an appetizer to lunch. I'm going to make this and then enjoy it while I'm in the kitchen making lunch. And I wanted to make something different, you know, I, 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 I mentioned from time to time I can get in ruts with the way I'm eating and I'm kind of eating the same things, the same smoothies. So um, I've been buying some different frozen fruits and uh, mixing my smoothies up lately. And I said with winter coming, why not have a good vitamin C boost here? Um, although, although it's kind of a, it's kind of a myth that you can just load, overload on vitamin C and protect yourself or cure uh, colds and flus, but we do need that vitamin C. So, but we're going to start out here and I got my, my Vitamix is a little bit grungy. I need to do a little work on the cloudiness here. I cleaned a little bit this morning, going to clean a little bit more. Now what I have here is I've got two peeled oranges. And yeah, I'm going to put them in there whole. I used to do a lot of juice in the past, but um, I don't do so much with the fruit juices anymore. Then I've got a little bit of uh, frozen mango. Put a nice little portion in there, about like that. And then I have some frozen pineapple as well. I'm going to go a little bit heavier with the pineapple than I did with the mango. So it's looking about like that, the way it's packed up. Then we're just going to add a little bit of water. Now with the water, I'm going to probably, I don't want to add too much. I'm funny about the consistencies of my smoothies. I have certain consistencies that I just really like. Um, one for my green smoothie and one for my fruit smoothies. So let's see how it comes. needs a little bit more water. Now why didn't I put more water in before? Because I don't know exactly how much it's going to need and I don't want to do overdo it with the water. I always get so angry when I do that and I do it from time to time. I'll be in a hurry making a smoothie and I get impatient and before I know it it's just way too thick. I saved a little time for you there just watching blending and pouring more water in. I added water a couple more times but just in small small increments until I got just the consistency I like. And your consistency might be different than mine. You might use more water, you might use less but let's see how it turned out. Looks good doesn't it? Isn't that a beauty right there? Ooh, look at that. All right let's see. Oh yeah, that's good. That's really good. That's like a treat. That one, that's that's so good. That's almost like you feel like you're cheating, like you're having dessert or something. But uh, only thing that might have made that a little bit better was just a little tang. Uh, if I'd have had some ginger in the house, I'd have probably uh, added a small piece of ginger to it. So uh, nice, refreshing, full of vitamin C. Give it a try. Let me know what you think. Peace.